Hello and welcome to episode 63 of Idol Slayer 100% Achievement Journey. Today we look at update 4.6, very interesting with new area, new quests, all sorts of new things, including a lot of new Steam achievements. Let's check it out. This is the only clip from before the update. Here will ascend and increase my ascension CPS bonus. What I had in mind is what I talked about probably last episode where I was all discouraged about the 500 trillion requirement for Stone of Rage. Now I understand how the ninja works thanks to uh, GC Heroes and our discussions. So here I had in mind to really make a lot of money, a ton of money, and in a passive way let the Cyclops and the ninja make me rich, especially in terms of uh, coins. This would give me achievements, etc. Now with this update, it's an interesting one, we'll generate at least two episodes, we'll see what we'll do, but I decided to ascend and now let's look at the update. And I started recording right from uh, the first second because I knew a lot of achievements would pop. Amazing, look at that, come on. And the music was changed, look at the background in the city, it looks awesome. It's unfortunate we won't get to see the hills today, but next episode I promise I'll show you. And this music is awesome, let's listen to some of it. Yeah, that's good stuff. And we're done with the achievements, we got them all. I'm not interested in this bonus stage. <laughs> I do that often, I'm skipping those boxes, I keep doing it. So, uh, good news is they finally reduced the price so I can buy uh, the Sacred Tone of Death. But uh, is that sufficient for me to Ultra Ascend? Please let me know in the comments. Honestly, I don't feel it at all. This is to unlock the funky space we're gonna go there today. Uh, yeah, I don't really think that ascending, uh, no, ultra ascending will be smart at all. I looked up what this is about. Am I right when I say there's only one special Dark Divinity so far? Unless the wiki is wrong or something. But the only thing I would get is a ring. I'm not going to do a full ultra ascension just for a ring. I don't think it's smart. What I have to do is find a way to get 500 trillion SP. Or maybe hope that the price goes down, I don't know. Let's go to the village because I read there was new stuff in the village. Let's check it out. Decided to look out the window somehow. It was the right decision. Let's see what he says. Have you found anything? Well, I'm still on the case. Did I go? Let me show you something. Oh, yeah, of course. Was there... Okay, my question is, was this there before... I fought the boss. Did I not go back to the village, right, after beating the boss? So let me know in the comment if this is new. Thank you again, Slayer. So, I have this feeling that this was already there in the sense that once you beat the boss, you talk to him and show him that. I don't know. We'll have to see. Uh, but there's something that's definitely new, though when I get out of here. Let's go. We'll switch characters by the way because Agnes apparently was modified. Oh, let's take the opportunity to get another achievement. We'll upgrade our sword. There you go. Bring it to level 10. So yeah, I'm gonna equip uh, Agnes and please let me know in the comments what was changed? I'll even walk with the character at one point. It seems like it's the way the character walks that was changed, and I'm not certain I would have to look at old footage, but I'd rather have you tell me. There you go, here's item plus 10. All we're missing now is plus 13. And in here, I already saw. Something was not normal. Normally the little minion is beside him. Slash the tree. Sorry I'm busy. Now I'm going to slash the tree and help this fella see what it gives us. If I do this, you got to give me something though. 
You have to. So what do I get? And it better be good. Let's see. Bat longbow. So we're gonna look at it a bit later. Key armory item. So it's pretty good. We'll look at it. Uh, when I look at the armory, because they revamped the way the armory is uh, the UI, I guess. So here, that's new. That's new. So do you want me to expand the O card? O chart? Yes, I do. But I'm gonna have to farm a bunch of mats now. So that's what I'll do. That's why I was not 100% certain I'll be able to release a video today. As in Sunday, you know. Anyways, let's get out of here. Alright, so we're back in town. <laughs> you saw me walking here. Uh, you can rewind if you like. I think it's the walking that was changed. So we got a white stone. I need some materials. But I've been doing it for a while. Look at the slimes, right? I'm just showing you the end of it. So at 9.10, we're gonna go uh, get out at this place. Despite the music being awesome. Again, very good gel on the background. I really like it. So we have a new quest here that is not Nazis. And they're perfect for the perfect for where I'm going, the jungle. It's just that I'm missing something, you'll see. And then the get ridden thing is for the new area. When I saw those stars, it will sound odd, but the first thing I thought is okay, you go there and then you uncover or you discover what the stars mean. There's information that's given to you. Uh, because you see souls and you see money. So the star is the amount or something, but no, it's three stars for the highest, one star for the lowest. So I'm going to show it again with my mouse. I'll point to each one to understand uh, what this means. Well, originally, I thought you spend some time to gather information. Also, I was looking for the modern city, but I was there already, so it doesn't show. That's why I was scrolling so much. So uh, here, unfortunately, I don't have enough wood for neither of those. I won't be able to do that quest. We'll do that next episode. Next episode, we'll do a lot of quests. So I need root. And after a while, I got all the root I needed. And this is the armory, the way it is now. Okay. And they separate normal items with key items. I don't know if the ring is considered a key item, but uh, anyways, key item, here's the bow that I was given, plus one damage against enemies and bosses, right, and 100% dark type souls. It's cool, especially for the boss, we might encounter the boss or another boss, because there might be other bosses uh, in the future, so it's cool and give us an achievement. All right, so let's get out of here because we're at 910 and now it's time to go to Mystic Valley. And you can see I didn't get that many kills. And look at that, I really have to, especially with the new quest we're going to look at later today, that rock smash thing, I'm going to have to do it. And you'll get to see the new hills because I forgot to go. I ran out of time though, I would have had to wait another hour or <laughs> uh, find a way to get five jewels or so, maybe buy them. So, no, we'll wait next episode. Here, I'm pointing to the star. So, hot desert three stars for gold and soul, it's best place for sure. And I was surprised to see Haunted Castle look at that three and two stars higher than I would expect. But, anyways, it's interesting that they add that. Another pin box that we don't take Mystic Valley, time to farm for wood. White stone will give me a perfect excuse to go back to the hills in a later play session. Go to the village and finally, I was skipping another box too. Just in case I miss my jump and I jump over the portal, I was pretty paranoid. Okay, and let's see what we get. Gotta talk to him. But I gotta finish it. Yeah, I gotta go build, right? 
Okay. All right, I hope I'm gonna get something good. All happy, yeah. I'll let Sabrina know about it. So Sabrina, I thought Sabrina was probably in the tavern. But then I check, unless it's her. No, that's Amelia. Do you want to get you here? Yes, I do. I check if I could upgrade that uh, bow that I got. But I can't. Which is good news, I'll save some uh, divinity points. Let's go see Sabrina, that's Sabrina. So, new special drink for me to try. Okay. And gives me 50 times coin for 30 seconds. If I have 20 times CPS and 9600 or something like that, I think I could use a village portal, go here and get this. What I was trying here to do is get another one to increase the duration, it's only 30 seconds. But this is how you make a lot of money when you have all these bonuses plus 50 times coins value, which is the maximum, plus maybe uh, the CPS, um, how do you call it again? Compass, CPS Compass, there you go. And here I am, uh, I was talking about that process, right? Getting some uh, jewels of souls to open a portal. That's what I'm doing right now, just to save some time so I can make a video for today and trying to go to the new area. That explains why we never reached the hill today. Let's go. Let's go explore this new place. Super curious about it. No, I sort of missed it. And there's another box above my head again. <laughs> Funky place. Achievement. All right. So uh, there's a quest attached to this area and it unlocks a package of brand new quests that will complete. I'll try to do them all for next episode. So uh, let's listen to this awesome music. So, you will notice that mobs don't get one shot, they get two shots. Uh, so, it might be a challenge for some of the quests. We'll see what they are. There's one of the quests that requires killing mobs with arrows. So, I may have to make some adjustment. We'll see later. Here's a <laughs> chess hunt. So, if I show you one, there's a reason. Let me just zoom in here. There you go. 100 chess hunt. I only need 900 more. But I need perfect ones too. But we might have a good news regarding this. So now I have access to both staves and this is going to help a lot. Look how much kills I get, how many kills I get. But I'm not going to show you the whole sequence. Why don't we cut and we'll come back at the end. The, the 10 last seconds. There you go. And we'll finish this so we can have access to a bunch of quests. We'll look at what they are. We're not going to get started officially, of course. It will be next episode. I might already know the name of the next episode. You might see it right here. I don't promise that will be the name, but it's really possible. So let's see what each give. Dark type enemies, there's at least... The jungle, I don't know for the rest, but uh, gives me bonus random event situation plus 30%. That's a lot. Nice. 10% CPS. 15% bonus soul, I always want this. Just killing vultures. 15% bonus CPS. So, fun clouds? I thought it was the... Uh, the little notes there they're the normal mobs on the ground they're walking or dancing the little fellas there 
So we gotta kill them with arrows. And it says I killed zero so far. So to do that, I decided to try it out. To do that, I'll have to turn off a divinity. So let's try it out right now. I felt like it. Make sure that I understand that uh, that's the solution. Not this one, but this one. After all this time, I always shoot with a delay. Uh, so I forgot that I can mash the button here. So I'm shooting at these notes and not just I don't get kills. That means it's the ground dancing fellas that I have to kill. So here's some kills right there. So we're gonna do that without the uh, dark divinity that adds a delay to my shooting. And all I have to do is mash. I try to remember to do that's not very difficult. Here, here I should be mashing the button. Right. <laughs> Back to the basics. Come on. Okay, so here I gotta kill Jade Giants for 3% better chance of... Uh, no, 3% chance of getting a silver random box for free. But I didn't complete the quest in the hills. Far from it. So I have to do that. That's gonna take a while. How about this? Get plus 5% chance of getting two materials instead of one. Very welcome. Mimics you encounter have 1% chance of losing to you. This is interesting. That will help me get some of those achievements in the uh, chess hunt. Well, I guess we chose our character for next episode. I gotta kill 55,000 blue milk mushrooms. I'll go in the jungle, complete the first quest that gave me access to that mob. And 20% more souls for mobs killed with the bow. Amazing. And this one is 20% bonus souls. All right. So that's interesting. That will help me get that 500 trillion a little faster. I do cross my fingers that there will be an extremely major increase in soul income or just a price reduction for that stone of rage. I understand they have to be careful not to uh, make it too easy at quote unquote, like if they want 50 trillion or 100 trillion would be ridiculous. Um, they can keep it like this, I suppose. If you look at the poll that I made, something like 8% have it already. So it's really an end game piece. So I'll do what I can to try to find a way to uh, reach that ridiculous objective, which will give me an achievement, this one. Wow. I'll figure it out. That's what I got for you. Next episode, I'll work on those quests and try to find a way to get that 500 trillion SP that I need to finally get Stone of Rage and Ultra Ascend. I hope you like this video. If you did, please hit thumbs up and leave a comment below. If you want to support this channel, you can subscribe and hit the description bell to make sure you don't miss future videos. Thank you for watching and see you next time.